So I'm the LV team leader within the power systems department at the Bristol Port Company. So we're an electrical department. We have proactive and reactive maintenance as well as we carry out installation work. Some of the installations that we work on are infrastructure. So that's all building electrical installations, car plot lighting, street lighting. When we first started using the headset, it took 15, 20 minutes probably to get used to looking through the viewfinder. Once we had mastered that, then yeah, I'd find the headset really easy to use, to use on all the voice commands and just having all of your documentation that you could pull up on the headset there is very useful. So within our department, I, yeah, I can definitely see this working with regards to giving the headset less experienced members of the team. We found that you could have a senior member that would just set some of the juniors off on tasks. They then go off and use the workflow. They can follow maintenance plans and it's just given them sort of step-by-step -step guidelines on to how to carry out certain tasks. The remote calling uh, could be a really useful feature where if uh, a guy is just looking after that little bit more guidance, he can dial in to a experienced member of the team and they'd be able to give them step-by-step step -step advice on how to overcome any problems. Within our workshop, we tend to do a lot of training with our apprentices. So we found that uh, using Arcset XR Sense we could use the step-by-step -step guides on there to upskill a lot of the apprentices. The development of the AI technology and how it can, you can use it to adapt to a sort of noticing anomalies within the installation and automatically picking those up and pushing that into our asset management system could be very useful. When we have technicians out on site, it's very useful to have a guy on location automatically on the XR Sense headset, he'll then be able to see all the relevant jobs open in that area. So he can just, he can filter in into those jobs, carry out the tasks, and then all of that information then gets uploaded onto the asset management system.